Tech Sports with Brandon Gardner. Well, we had some volleyball action all across North Dakota tonight, but here in the Magic City, we had the newest rivalry in the state facing off as the North Sentinels welcomed in the Minama Jets. Now, although it's a rivalry, both of these schools came in conjunction tonight and hosted a blockout cancer night to play for a cause and raise funds for local families affected by cancer. Let's go to the highlights from Minot North Campus as everything was in all pink. First set and everything's all knotted up at one. And it'll be the senior outside hitter, Leah Walter, sending a laser towards the hardwood and she'll put the Majest up by one with the kill. Later in the set, Sitwell's down 9-2. And senior leader, Katie Shipman, says enough is enough as she gets the powerful kill to stop the bleeding. But that bleeding will commence again as Leah Walter will show off her bunnies all first set long. And that would put the Majest up 16-9 in the first set. And look at the North Sentinels coming from down 2 to nothing and getting the win in five sets. A cross-town rivalry in the capital city between number three century and legacy. First set, Sabres with a commanding lead. And McKenna Brindell will add to it, going down the line with this powerful spike to extend the legacy lead. Set point now for the Sabres off of the Patriots serve, going back to Brindell. And the senior clinches the opening set, sneaking this one just inside the back line. But here comes Century in the second set, starting it off again, Atriana Backman, who shows off her strength with the trio of kills as the Patriots open the second game with the lead. And the Patriots beat Legacy 3-1. Other scores from the WDA, St. Mary lose on the road against number 5 Jamestown in five sets, while Wofford City defeats Turtle Mountain in four. Moving to Class B, Shallow Christian facing center Stanton. First set, Skyhawks trailing. The cue the comeback, Olivia Nelson getting it started with a pair of touches. That finds the floor and Shallow ties it up. But Nelson, not the only one fueling the comeback. Senior Peyton Shock shook getting involved and giving Shallow the lead with a trio of kills, consistently finding no man's land on the court. Skyhawks now in control and Betsy Haddlestad will keep the good times rolling, bringing the boom on this spike as Shallow wins 10 straight points en route to a big win over the Wildcats at home in straight sets. Looking at other Class B scores, Flasher takes down Kill during straight sets, and Emma Jones and the Glenburn Panthers defeat the Bishop Ryan Lions in five, while Dickinson Trinity takes down Hedinger Scranton in straight sets. Fifth ranked South Prairie, they'll take down Surrey in straight sets, while number eight are Redeemers, they take down Berthold in straight sets. Third ranked Central McLean back at home against Wilton Wing Winning in straight sets, and top ranked Linton taking care of business on the road against Napoleon Gackle Streeter.